Yo, what's going on, Sexy Sam? Let us go today. We're doing a ranked one v one, and I am playing Charybdis because I want to attack very fast. That's literally the only, the only reason. Just very fast auto attacks. That's it. I want oboe. I want uh, like crit chance, the demon blade thing. And that's it. I fought this guy four times, and three out of the four times, he's literally just stood in his base. And then uh, at around the four or five minute mark. He'll come out and start defending his Phoenix and not surrendering. Which is just honestly obnoxious as shit. Because not only is he like not playing the game, which makes it not fun. He's also not surrendering at five and just prolonging the game for no reason other than to annoy me and stop my recordings. Because I woke up at seven today, 7 a.m. And it's 8.30 right now and I haven't gotten a recording. Which is pretty unfortunate. But, you know... It's just, uh, it's just what he's doing. I think this is that DB London guy, the guy that always said, like, fight me on Japan servers. I think this is him. Um, the reason that I don't think he says anything to me is because I have him blocked. So I've never actually, I, I think he changed his name. So I never actually, uh, uh, talked to him. Oh, there he is. Hello. Are you going to play this game? Nope. No gameplay. Oh, maybe gameplay. Oh, maybe he'll play this game, dude. That's exciting. He's out of mana. Okay. Oh, he sprinted away. Well, let's go for red. See what happens here. Maybe I'll come over here. Nope. He can't. He would have died. All right. Well, we lived. And we got the red buff. I'll take it. That's an early game. Not a great early game, but but it's an early game. I mean, nothing's great about Charybdis, right? She's one of those characters that's like, eh. She could not exist in Smite, and I don't think the game would change at all. Basically. Oh, Lord, he's coming. Ow. Nice. Nice. Killed me in spam laughed after not even playing the past four games. Classic, dude. Classic. I actually wouldn't be surprised if he just stopped playing now. Get his blue buff. Hello. Nice. I'll take that blue. Thank you. I still need one more. Uh... I need one more minion for my golden. There we go. Now I just need damage on him, which shouldn't be that hard to get. Uh, I just need to auto attack him a little bit. Where are you going? <laughs> Come on, I want my golden gooseberries, man. It's all right. I got my gooseberries. I'm a happy man. I'm a happy man with some gooseberries, dude. Oh, 
Oh, yeah. Look at that clear now, dude. That is exciting clear. I'm just going to run away. I'm probably just going to take tower here. Actually, I don't think I do enough damage to take tower here. Well, maybe I do. It's actually more damage than I thought I would do. I'll be honest. I did not think I'd get that close. Nice. Well, you got some defense. He's going to come for red buff. Nope. Yes. Nice. Punk. I'm just going to run this way. Almost. He's just laughing at me, man. <laughs> you got to you, you got to just like you got to fight it funny, right? Okay. Well, this is Horn Shard. I have so much gold, by the way. If you angle Charybdis 1 at the wall perfectly, then you can actually double bounce the, the spikes. All right, let's go Aussie into Shoguns. Oh, just kidding. I can't build tier 1 Shoguns. Not yet. Hold on, I'm going to sneeze. Jeez Louise, man. Alright, he's probably doing his blue. Hey, at least he's playing this game out, though. Like, sure, he's, like, like spam laughing and taunting and, like, being weird. But, like, at least he's playing. It was better than the other games. I'll take what I can get these days, dude. I'll take what I can get these days. Hello? You want to fight me? Just sprinting away. Ow. All right. Shogun's is 2200. Uh, if the treasure chests are here, I might be able to do it. Oh, they're not. Damn it. <clears throat> I don't even know where they are. Are they over here? Oh, they are over here. Hello. Hello, wave. I'm going this way. He's got all the shit out of me here. I actually might die here. <laughs> Oh, he surrendered. Well, <clears throat> trying to ruin another recording, I guess. But at least he played that time. I'm just going to double feature it. Who cares? Let's just see what happens. I'll see you next game. Welcome back to game two of Charybdis. Technically game five. Oh, who's counting, right? <laughs> Honestly, at this point, I should freaking... Oh, I used a worship. I didn't... When did I get Charybdis diamond? Why do I have this god diamond? That's crazy. I have 504 battle points boosters. I got a lot of boosters, dude. I'm pretty boosted up. Zing Tin. Wow, I wonder who this could be. He passed all his bands, by the way. Again. I'm curious... I unblocked him to ask him. You are called here 
here by the cosmos for like, a reason. Does he have anything to say? It's time we use our he didn't say anything. To bring so to these chaotic lands. I think his goal in life is to annoy me. Which, you know, at least he has a goal. You know, we, <laughs> we take what we can get these days. At least he has a goal. <clears throat> I kind of want to do red. But I also feel like he's just going to walk at me no matter what I do. Or he'll sit in base. So like one of the two. He'll either sit in base or he'll walk at me. Uh, I think he's in base. Oh, there he is. Going to red. Dropped a ward on me. <clears throat> you got teleport. <laughs> you got teleport. What the fuck? <laughs> Why did he get teleport? <laughs> All right. Well played. He's also doing his blue buff. I guess he did his blue buff. I'm like half dead, dude. Hello. Hello. Do you clear wave well? That probably answers my question. I'm pretty sure I cannot get this. But I'm going to go for it anyways. Ah, oh well. Okay. Do -do -do -do. Should I? What should I do here? I feel like he's just gonna invade me again. Like, oh, why did I do that? I feel like he's just waiting to invade me again. Nope, he's not. Interesting. He fully upgraded his teleport and he bought Vision Ward. <laughs> okay, let's see what kind of shenanigans he's gonna pull. Let's see it. I'm interested. Oh, hello. We thought we were strong enough. <laughs> oh, funny. That's funny. You know, he does he does have teleport and visual ward. He might pull some shit. He might pull some shit. I think I killed myself. <laughs> He's running at me, man. No. He's laughing at me. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Man, I don't know. What did I do to this guy? Like, why is he this mad at me? Did I actually ever do anything to him? Or did I just beat him in some duels and he said, fight me in Japan servers? And I said, no. Like, uh, did I break into his house and, like, seduce his mother? Genuine question. I actually have no idea what I did. I'm just trying to get my, my thingy up. Into tower he goes. 
teleport <laughs> teleport a tower. Oh my god. I don't even know, man. I don't even know what I should think, to be honest. But, you know, who cares? I'm playing Charybdis. Hello. Okay, goodbye. I think he's actually just trying to annoy me. Okay. He's just following me around. He surrendered. He surrendered. All right. I don't know what to do. I will either end the video here. Thanks for watching. If you enjoyed vid the video, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. Or I'm going to queue up again, and it's going to be him again, and I'll play Crypdis again. I we'll see. Who knows? I'll either see you guys in the next game, or uh, the video ends here. Well, boys, he banned Crypdis. We've made it. I'll show you just in case you don't believe me. <laughs> Ivan Charybdis, Robin, Kukolkin, I don't know, something else. I'm just playing new one now. At this point, I don't know what to do other than just, I'm just going to fight him for like an hour. I don't know. He thinks he's ruining my recordings at this point, but I'm farming content off of him. <laughs> that's what it's, that's what it's come to. Not only do I not care if you queue, but I think my content gets better if you queue, so I appreciate it. But I'm not going to tell him that, because then he'll stop queuing. I wonder, like, what this plan is going to be. Because the first one is Geb. And he wanted to kill me. The next one was Zing Tin, and he wanted to teleport to Wards. I wonder what this one is. I saw you. Hello. Blink. Oh, he's looking to kill me again. Okay. Okay. This is a Blink game. My assumption is he's not going to let me do my buff. I was wrong. He let me do my buff. Probably just because he can do his, you know? Like, just as fast, if not faster. Oh. 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 Hello? I want to fight. Hello? Let's be besties. Wait, I want to fight. He ran. He ran. And he died. I'm not going to get my ult. There's no point. Uh, I don't know, man. I thought he would actually put up a fight there. He tried, I think. I have beads, though, so I'm not very scared of him. Oh, look at that thing bounce. That thing is bouncing. All right. Ran away. Well, let's get tower then. I am Nuwa. Oh, my minion. My minion betrayed me. Let's stop his back. 
<laughs> oh, stupid. <laughs> All right, let's go back. <laughs> let's just go back. Uh, Chronos pending. Genji's just so he can't kill me. And then I'm going to keep W key on him. He'll pro I feel like he'll probably stop Q1 after this game. I would imagine, right? This is what, like... He surrendered two Charybdis games and then played one of them. Yeah, I mean, like, look at that. <laughs> Maybe he realizes that I'm actually getting content out of him now and he's like, fuck. I don't know. I normally don't do, like, long, long form videos on Fridays, but, like, this is kind of asking to be a long form video. He's proxying my wave. But also, I'm new wa, so like, you can proxy all you want. It's not actually gonna do anything because I can do this. Oh, there he is. He showed up. He recognized. Blue buff. Thank you. Maybe I just go Shogun's instead of Genji's, dude. I just get more attack speed. And just go for Phoenix. It's not a bad play, right? I almost have a maxed out of uh, minions. Almost. Kind of close. I should get it next level, right? Level 10? <laughs> Hello. Oh, thank you. This Nene is beating my ass. Man. Okay. 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 He's just looking around for me. Oh, he blinked in the tower. <clears throat> hmm. I think he was going to see if he could die before I spawned, so I couldn't ult him. But then he realized I was going to spawn too fast, so he ran away. <clears throat> but it's okay. He's probably going to surrender in like a second. No. Well, if he didn't surrender then, he's going to surrender right when I'm winning a fight. Right before he dies. Probably. He's going to stand here. Give it a second. Give it a second. Give it a second. There it is. <laughs> I knew it. All right, I'll see you guys next game. All right, gamers, I'm back. This time he banned Nuwa and Charybdis, so I'm playing Sir Cat. Uh, he's playing Maui. <laughs> he's just picking all the Guardians, man. I don't even know why. I don't even know why, man. What is the point? What is the point? Honestly, like, at this point in the video, all we're going to do is just keep killing him. Like, he's, we know he's going to surrender. Once five minutes passes, the next time he's about to die, he's going to surrender. So, like, just get to that point, make him surrender as quick as we can, and go next, you know? I'm going to hang out at his blue buff. Maybe he'll do it for me. You never know. Or maybe he saw me walk over here and I look like a dumbass. That would be funny. Oh, there he is. Hmm. 
You got deer through the fence. <laughs> nice. <sighs> I don't think you're going to clear away very, very easily. He's out of mana. <laughs> He's out of mana, dude. <laughs> that fast? Come on, man. Don't load dump that quickly. All right, let's see if we can do this. Nice beads. Nice beads, nice beads. Oh, the minions are here. Well, let's see him clear the wave. Let's let's watch in disbelief as he clears. <laughs> he can't clear, man. Alright, he's coming. Let's just do the buff. Hello. I'll see you that way. All right. First blood, baby. Let's go. That's the sign of a skilled gamer. A guy who can get first blood and a red buff. I guess I'll just blink this way. There's not really anything else to do. I don't know why I'm making this video, to be honest. Like, I'm giving him the attention he wants. Out of me. But at the same time, like, it's kind of funny, right? Because he gets the attention he wants, but I get, like, literal money off of him. Like, I could go buy dinner because of Mr. D.B. Hudson tonight. I mean, maybe not tonight, but, like, in a week, once this video, like, makes enough money to buy dinner, I could go buy dinner. You know, like, that's sick. That's literally drinking haterade. Like, take a hater, farm them for content, and then, like, go buy a bottle of wine or something. You know? Excuse me. You're out of mana again already. <laughs> you run out of mana so fast, my guy. Where are you going? Where are you going? 29. My alt only hits him for 29. All right. What is he doing? He's running around like a literal bot. Hello? Hello? All right. Um, I mean, let's just go serrated. Get some pen online because he's going double defense. I knew when he started defense, he was going to go double defense. So just starting some pen is fine. Meow. I crit him for 69. I don't think he knows he can drop it. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Oh, that's a good one. Oh. Oh. 
Oh no, I died. <laughs> I died to tower, man. And then he surrendered. All right, fine. I'll see you guys next game. <laughs> What's up, boys? Welcome to the next game. This guy passed all his bans. He didn't even ban Charybdis, so it might not be him. It might just be a ban passer. The Whiffed Queen. It's a different person. It's a different person, dude. No way. I'm playing Nemesis. I don't really know why. Um, I like playing Nemesis as the, a one-hit character, just like I, I like playing uh, Kali as a one-hit character. Excuse me. Because I like like alt and then hydras plus crit chance plus serrated. And then you alt them. Maybe you have Aerodite. I don't know. You alt them and you slap them once. It's a crit for like 550 damage. And then you two and then you slap them again. And it's another crit for like 550 damage and they die. That feels good to me. <laughs> okay. My combination of attacks is only 115 mana. And I have 474 mana. Plus 12 MP5 because Transcendence and Multipoth. So I think I can start Red Buff here. I should be fine. I'm excited to actually play the game again, dude. I've been recording for for two hours. Have Granted, I have like, like, I don't know, 35 minutes of footage of me just slapping that guy. But by the way, I've been recording actually for like... Like this this one single recording is an hour long of me just fighting that guy. But because the games are sh so short with him, uh the queue times are just as long as the games, so my recording time is not accurate to what it should be, I think. Like getting the red buff feels really good on Nemesis. Like really good. Now I can dash, auto dash, auto, and clear pretty darn quick. Now his clear is going to be better than mine on the wave because I sacked it for the blue buff, but that's okay. Just tank whatever damage he can. I am level five. Maybe I just fight him. Okay. Nice. Honestly, using alt for pressure here is worth it. Using alt just to get pressure. Double buff, plus I'll clear this wave, plus I'll get the XP camp. I'll be able to back with Transcendence. That's pretty damn good, honestly. Because he's going to be busy on this wave. So I can get the XP camp for free. Good stuff. I'm not mad about this. Finish Transcendence. Get my mana back. And just start moving over. I'm already like 100 gold ahead. I still have to wait one minute. Literally one full minute for treasure chest to spawn. But I am just kind of just kind of vibing. Hello. Neo, Neo. Just group him in with the wave so that my uh my two not only hits the wave, but it also pokes him a little bit. Look at my damage, bro. Look at my damage. Like, Transcendence is so strong, man. Such a good item. Want to make sure I get the last hit. Uh, I do want to go Hydra's next. And I can get tier 2, so we'll just do that. I was thinking maybe I'll go Genji's next. Or I could go Shogun's, but I think I might just go full power. Like, fuck it, full power completely. Six items of all damage. Yeah, I mean, dude, what do you do? 
What do you do if you're the soul there? I'm literally W keying you and killing you so fast. I don't really want the blue buff. So his alt is down. Are you backing? You are backing. I thought it was a bait back, but it was a real back. Take this. My two is now maxed out. Give me that XP. Thank you. Stack, stack. Treasure chests are spawned now. I just have to find them. I assume they're over there, but they could be there. Not much really happening. The treasure chests are here, which is actually really good for me. Thank you. And thank you. I don't think he's coming over here. Uh, I mean, let's just alt for pressure. Fuck it. Nice. Nice. I'm gonna this. Let's go serrated now. I should have bought a, a health chalice just now, but it's fine. I'm sure it's okay. I'm actually kind of surprised he didn't surrender because I, I did just kind of manhandle it. Look at that damage, dude. What the fuck? Like, actually, that's insane. My three is almost maxed out, which is really good for sustain. My two hit him for 315. I think he's probably just going to hang out under his tower for the rest of the game because I'm kind of just abusing him. I mean, if you were him, though, like, what do you, you, you would also know, like not know what the fuck to do against this. Any tips on how to build soul? Probs need a berserkers or cooldown. All right, blue buff is mine. Don't you walk back over here. You're dead. You're dead. Let's go grab red buff. Love the streams. Oh, Pog. He's a viewer. I, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry that you're being manhandled like this. I come from a situation of despair. <laughs> I respect the build though. Like the full damage build, seeing me go full damage and just repeating. I do respect it. Although I don't think it's in your best interest. Not for this game at least. If you're ahead, then by all means, do the full damage build. If you're behind, you're probably going to need Berserkers because he needs attack speed. He's also going to want to get... I mean, his build's not bad, right? Because he, once he gets Typhons, he's actually going to do a lot of damage. And then he could just spend 600 gold on Nimble and he's already going to have a lot of power. The problem is just he dies too fast right now. Like, if he gets Berserkers, Typhons, and the 600 Nimble from Bancroft, he's actually, like gonna hold his own damage wise I think but for now you really have to run away 
I kill you way too easy. I was a little close. I'll admit. I was a little bit, a little bit close. Tower down, big Mordor. But I'm still alive. Uh, I guess we just go blink. And I'm just gonna wait for Arendite. It's only 70 gold. There's no XP up on the map. All the treasure chests are done. XP camps done. Uh, buff camps are done. I mean, Bull Demon is up, but I don't think he's gonna run to Bull Demon. All right, so he's got Typhon. So he actually does do damage now. And he's got a lot of healing. Because he has his one, and he's got triple life steal. And he's got damage off of his life steal. So he's actually pretty scary now in terms of damage output. But I am four levels ahead at this point, so. I think I can still just run at him. As long as I have my three up, I can run at him. If I don't have my three, he might actually be able to kill me. Phoenix is down. Lovely. Blue buff is down. I got a text. Check it. <laughs> this ship is so cute, man. He's so cute. Um. Oh, well, there's the Berserkers. He got horrific, too. Actually, a good ass play. Sprint or Horrific are both good, but because the fact that he has his three, which makes him slow immune, um, he doesn't need the sprint. So Horrific actually is a really good play. And me not going any defense makes, once he gets that Berserkers, oh man, actually scary. He could maybe hold here. It's going to be scary for him. Actually, no, he's dead here, I think. Dude, that timing, that timing on his uh, detransformation, I don't even think he was detransformed fast enough for the game to recognize it. I just have the timing down on Souls 3 so fast. I just tried to ult the Titan. <laughs> I don't know why. <laughs> Oops. Uh, I have 2,700 gold. I could just go grab... I could just go grab a uh, uh, heart seeker. Dude, I think blink, alt, heart seeker. No, blink, alt, auto two, and he dies. I don't even think I need the second auto. Actually, I might with the mitigation he gets from this. Let's find out. Oh, good shell. Ow. You used both relics really well. I want him to hit his two on me here. Nope. Okay. Okay, he's better than me. He baited me. I guess I'll just go do Bull Demon again.
He can't come over to Bold even because there's a fire minion wave at his Phoenix. Oh, okay. Well, he, he loses uh, he loses his Phoenix anyways. I should be fine. Actually, I might be able to turn this fight, to be honest with you. Oh, I was going to dash past him. He would miss the two and then I would dash back through him. And I think my three would be up by then. <clears throat> That's okay. Phoenix down again. We're vibing. He, I mean, like the goal of Bull Demon obviously is to get Phoenix. If I get Phoenix while dying at Bull Demon, my goal is still met, you know? You better run, gamer, because I am here and I have my ult. You're dying for tower. You, 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 I think you just lost the game for tower. All right, rule of thumb. If you lose anything for getting an objective, if the objective is not Phoenix or Titan, don't do it. Don't die for red buff. Don't die for tower. Don't die defending Phoenix. Because if you die defending Phoenix, then you lose Titan. So the only way that you defend is if you won't die, or if you think you won't die, right? Like, obviously, sometimes you get caught off guard, you die, it happens, right? But don't die on porpoise getting a red buff, even though I do it sometimes. You see me do it all the time. Don't do that. Uh, don't die getting red buff. Don't die getting blue buff. Don't die getting a tower. And especially, most important, do not die defending Phoenix. It happens all the time. I see people do it all the time. They will like... Be like, oh, I have to defend my Phoenix. If I don't defend my Phoenix, I'll lose the game because I can't clear fire minions. If you die defending your Phoenix, fire minions are a non-factor because you lost the game anyways. Like, it, he'll kill your Phoenix and then kill your Titan if you're dead for, like, more than 15 seconds. And th the Titan does actually negative damage. So, I don't know. See you guys next game. Last game, by the way. What's up, gamers? Last game. We're fighting Dwift Queen again. And, uh... Past bands again. I figured I would just play a little bit of Chiron. I haven't played Chiron in a while. I never noticed that cute little ghost in the top left corner of his loading in screen. It's very cute. That's a nice loading in screen. I should I should let him know that I think it's cool. I like your loading in border. The little ghost in the top left is cute. I want to know what border it is, but I don't want to ask because I already complimented it. And then I feel like if I ask about it after complimenting it, then he's just going to think that I'm weird because it's like the only thing I care about. But the ghost is cute and I want to, I want it. <laughs> like, I just, I just want it. <laughs> I probably have it. I just, I'd have to go look for it. They need a search bar. Maybe they have a search bar. They probably have a search bar because they have like thousands of little knickknacks in the like character customization thing with like your borders and your titles and stuff like that you know i'm sure they they have something i should use this horn shard now because i want to use my ability again so that i'm not omega late because he's merlin and merlin does an absolute amazing job at clearing wave because abilities all right now uh i'm a hunter i'm gonna hunt oh nice aegis actually close to living because that aegis was really good not even gonna lie not even gonna lie. Oh god. 
All right, so the way you play Chiron, by the way, is you won the wave. You get your two on the whole wave, and then you try to hit him. Oh, I missed. And then after you, um, after you won the wave, you, like I said, you try to hit him so that you can clear the wave and poke at the same time with your two. And a lot of Chirons will actually max their two. Technically speaking, I'm pretty sure the two is worse to max no matter what. But it is better to max for poke because you, you put your one on the wave and then you hit him and then you two everything. And your two should clear the wave with the assist damage of your one and do a, like almost 200 damage to him. It's a good way to do it. I mean, like, it's not bad. It just... I've never tried it, so I'm not comfortable trying it right now. I'm more of a one the wave, hit him, clear everything at once kind of guy. You know, I will actually put a point in my two right now. Uh, I was thinking about alting him, but like it doesn't lead to anything, so there's no point. All right, there we go. Your blue comes up the same time my red does. I don't know why I'm checking it so often. Treasure chest spawn in two seconds. Not here, but here. Come this way, please. Thank you. I actually do want to see if I can alt his, his buff or steal it somehow. Nice. I am taking damage from them, but I don't know. Actually, he only has Chronos Pendant. Chronos Pendant doesn't have much damage on it. It's all about just the cooldown. It does make it feel a little like useless, kind of. Oh. Oops, I don't too soon. Uh, gold wise, two thousand. Crushers 2600. Right? Might be 27, actually. 25. Oh, Pog. Okay, so just one more wave and then I can go get Crusher. I wonder if he's maxing his two. Normally on Merlin, I max my one. And I just kind of stay in, uh, like, ice stance the whole time because poke damage. But he's using his two a lot. Makes me think he's maxing it. I don't know. I can't tell off the damage of his clear. I don't know Merlin that well. I, the Merlin is honestly one of those gods I should get better with because... When I play Merlin, I'm like, damn, people that play Merlin, like, actually own. And then I'll play Merlin, I'm like, why do I fucking suck? Like, why am I actual garbage? <laughs> He's definitely one of those gods that I need to practice. But I'll get there eventually. Eventually. As long as I dedicate some amount of time to him. All right, my one and my two are now evenly leveled, so my poke should be absolutely insane, especially if I hit my one. It is worth mentioning that you're supposed to auto attack and then use your two and then use your one technically because your two is a slow, which helps you confirm your one. But I don't like doing that. I'm going to go. I'm just going to wait for this. This blue buff is spawning soon, but I might be able to make it in time anyways. 
divine. It's not bad. Chiron's passive is strong. Okay, he's definitely leveling the one. If he was leveling the two, I would have cleared by now. Nice. Look at that damage, bro. What the fuck? Holy crap, I do a lot of damage. Oh my god. I didn't expect that to kill him. I mean, obviously he didn't either, because he had Aegis up. He had Aegis up, and he could have used it, but like, why would you expect my ult to hit for 200? One tick of my ult hit for 200. This early on. We're only seven minutes in, bro. I guess I am level 13. Our buff spawned. Do a little damage. Ouch. I kind of like leveling them together. The one and the two. It feels pretty good. I do want to try leveling out or maxing out the two first, though. I feel like that would be kind of fun. Like the the poke, I feel like would be insane. My right, treasure chest should spawn. So I guess they already have spawned, and they're probably in the corners. I'm just gonna grab this. I'm gonna grab a blink, and I'm gonna grab a 500 pot. And I'm just going to do so much damage. I'm so far ahead that a 500 pot's not bad, by the way. Because I hate early 500 pots. I think it's a great way to lose the game. Because if you die, not only are you giving them a shit ton of bounty gold, you're, uh, you're also giving them the 500 gold from the pot. However... Being 1,700 gold up and two levels up right now, I feel like it will help me kind of obliterate him. All right, now you Aegis, because you have to. Dead anyways. Give me this. And I should be able to just get this, I think. My auto attacks are not very fast, but my damage is 78 a hit, which might be enough. It is enough. Now, I do have to be careful. I, I want to, like, keep up the aggression and take another fight. Because that's just who I am as a person. But uh, I would die and feel like an idiot. Because I have a 500 pot. I really don't want him to get that blue, though. What's my next item? Uh, to me. Could just be Jotun's. I only have 10% cooldown right now. Jotun's is, is another power spike item. I'm three levels up. What does my alt do? 220 plus 135 per tick. That's almost a thousand damage. Holy shit. Bro, look at that damage. You've got to be kidding me. My two did 215. Just the poke of it. No, I will admit, he's got amazing clear. Yeah, I mean, dude, my damage. My damage. Like, holy crap. That's insane, right? I, 
I only hit two of my three ticks of my alt and it did almost 500. Wow. And he has defense, by the way. All right, GG. I hope you guys enjoyed this like pseudo, like weird kind of try hard Thursday where I did nothing for four games and then did something for two more. I don't know. Weird. I'm four MMR away from MMR cap now. Okay. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe. And until next time, y'all, peace.